The world's largest aircraft is about to take its first official flight. UK startup Hybrid Air Vehicles has developed the Airlander 10, reportedly the largest airplane in the world. The plane has about 20 hours of flight testing left and could be flying within weeks. The company has recently received clearance to fly the airship from the airfield at Cardington, Bedfordshire. The plane is being kept there in the UK's largest airplane hangar. Originally developed in partnership with Northrop Grumman for a now defunct US Army program, Airlander 10 is now being built as an aircraft capable of both commercial and military uses. The Airlander 10 could potentially carry sightseers, surveillance equipment, or special cargo. The airship is 302 feet long, 143 feet wide, and 83 feet high. It weighs 44,100 pounds. The envelope is filled with 1.34 million cubic feet of helium and gives the Airlander 10 a significantly lower carbon footprint than other forms of air transport. In comparison, the Hindenburg used 7.062 million cubic feet of hydrogen, which is much heavier than helium. Helium is also non-flammable. The shape of Airlander 10's envelope was designed to increase lift efficiency by 40%. Its structure creates a balance between economic flight, operational flexibility, range, and payload. The airship is equipped with four propellers, two at the back, one on the front left, one on the front right. These propellers provide vectored thrusts from four V8 turbo diesel engines. Much like a helicopter, the Airlander can take off and land vertically without the need for a tarmac runway. Airlander 10 can stay airborne for up to five days at a time if manned and for over two weeks unmanned. It has a 10-ton capacity, allowing it to carry roughly 48 passengers. Hybrid Air Vehicles hopes to be building 12 of these airships a year by 2018. The airship operated in a test flight for the first time in Lakehurst, New Jersey in August 2012 for the US military. However, the program was canceled in 2013. Earlier this month, Airlander 10 was officially named Martha Gwynne by the Duke of Kent. Previously, it was known as the Flying Bum. See a story that really should be animated? Suggest stories to Tomo News Now!